Yeah, so, so of course we always look at new, new drugs and, and, and better even systemic control of, of, of disease, but it's not easy. In rectal cancer, most of the tumors are microsatellite micro stable, and this is really important. There's only 1%, a little bit more than 1%, of the tumors that is microsatellite instable. For those tumors, we know we have to look for options with checkpoint inhibitors because data has shown that we can achieve really nice results and, and non-operative management in these often young patients. But it's a very, very small group. All the other patients with microsatellite stable tumors, for them right now, there is not, not enough evidence to include targeted therapies or immunotherapies in a new adjuvant um, uh, schedule and for rectal cancer, of course, we hope to one day get there, maybe with some new immunotherapies, more powerful immunotherapies or other targeted agents. But for now, we have to uh, rely on uh, chemotherapy, cytotoxic chemotherapy to, uh, to reach our goals.